Hi Adaptive PE Kids, I miss you and I hope you're doing great at home, which I know you are. And let me see, I want to get out my binoculars and who's out there today? Oh, I see Alex, I see Angelica, I see Miguel, and I see Jorge. Oh, I see lots of kids out there. I'm glad you're joining me today. Go and ask your parents if you can borrow dish towels. Okay, in the kitchen, or it can be a washcloth from the bathroom. Okay? And we are going to do our scarf activities. So, first thing we do is we're going to go big circle. Big circle. Like you're revving up an engine. There you go. Now switch directions. You can do this with other people in the house, but make sure you give each other lots of space so you don't hit anybody. Let's do the other arm. Back. Big circles back while we're stretching our arms. Be careful not to hit any furniture or lamps, okay? And forward. There we go. You're creating your own wind. Okay, now two arms. If these are our scarves, you know how we do scarf activities? Well, dish towels are just the same. And back. Two big arms. Okay, one arm up. I have a question. I want to be a helicopter. Show me your helicopter propeller. Big, big propeller. Big, big propeller. And the other arm. Make that dish towel go round and round. Big helicopter. Switch directions. Big helicopter. Now shake it out. Shake it. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it in front. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it in back. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Good job. Now we're gonna go ripple, just like on a lake. When you see the ripple of the water, or in the bathtub when you're playing, and you see the ripples in the water. Now we're gonna do big waves. Who likes to go to the beach? Who likes to play in the waves? I love playing in the waves and jumping. Now, crashing waves. Up, crashing waves. Bend your knees. Crashing waves. Put the other foot in front. Okay, here we go. Up, crashing waves. Up, crashing waves. Up, crashing waves. Good. Okay, legs apart. And we're going to just make a side to side, side to side. There we go. And here we go this way, like leaves swaying in the wind. Wow, you all are doing a great job. Johnny, Carlos, I like how you're doing it out there. Good. Okay, now we're going to have our, have our tish towels up, drop them, bend your knees, pick them up, drop them, bend your knees, pick them up. Can we do five of those? One, pick it up, drop, pick it up, two, three, pick it up, four, pick it up. And five, pick it up. Good job. You can come up with your own movements using your dish towels. You can pretend you're an animal and play charades and do all kinds of things. One fun thing is pretending like you're in the shower and scrubbing your back, drying your back while you're stretching your arms. Back and forth, back and forth, switch. And back and forth, back and forth, 
Did you get all the water off your back? I hope so. Let's drive our lower back. Back and forth, move those arms. Back and forth, and our upper back. With our neck. Back and forth. Back and forth. Oh, that felt good. I'm all dry. Okay, the next thing we're gonna do is, who has a ball in the house? If you don't have a ball, that's okay. You can use a stuffed animal. So I know you all have a stuffed animal. I'm gonna call my friend here, Mr. Victor. Mr. Victor went to Santa Ana schools just like you. And Mr. Victor, good to see you. Um, so Mr. Victor, what, tell the kids what schools you went to in Santa Ana. I went to Hoover, I went to Sierra, and I went to Century. Wow, so you, all the Santa Ana Unified, and I went to Lowell, Willard, and graduated from Santa Ana High School. So we both came from Santa Ana Unified. Yes. Can you stand right there and we're going to play some catch. So with my friend Victor, he's going to have his hands out and he's going to catch my animal. Or the ball, if you have a ball. And I throw up. I'm going to throw really high for Victor. Victor, can you catch this? Let's see. Oh, good catch. Real high, Victor. Woo! All right. Now I'm going to do it over my head, like this. Okay, ready? Over your head, two hands. Excellent. Over your head, two hands. Over your head. Boy, this tiger is doing good. Now, just one hand. One hand behind my back. And catch the tiger. Catch it. Throw it with one hand. And one hand. All right. Now I'm going to switch my hands and throw the tiger. Ready, Victor? Victor caught it with one hand. Victor, you're good at this. Thank you. Now, if this is too big of an animal, you can always use smaller ones, too. Beanie Babies work good. And we can do catch with one or two hands. And look at how we're using our hands to catch the Beanie Baby. There we go. Now, if you have a pot, or a bucket, or a hat, or anything that has shallow inside, we're going to play um, toss the beanbag into the bucket, or the pan, or the box. Okay, here we go. Ooh, I did it. Again, you can pause this video and do any kind of games you want, throwing the beanbag from a distance into the pot or the bucket and you can do overhand so watch how I do overhand I do close to my ear step throw so here we go he's gonna turn it this way so I aim it into the target here I go ear step throw I'm gonna have you go this way so they can see me ready ear step Ooh, I pivoted. Here we go. Ear, step, throw. Try it again. Ear, step, throw. I made it in. Do you want to try it? Yes. Do this with a friend, your mom or your dad. Go ahead. Underhand. Oh, underhand. underhand. You got it. Switch hands. Now, there we go. Underhand. You got it. Okay. Now, with your stuffed animal, you can go under the leg and switch your um, switch your feet. I meant switch your hands. <laughs> okay, so try this five times. One, two, three, four, and five. Now do the other leg. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, now we're gonna do some playing ball. If you have a ball, you can go bounce, catch, bounce, catch, bounce, catch, bounce, catch. And you can turn off the video and practice that. Bounce, catch, in your backyard or anywhere. And you can also practice bounce, 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 dribble, dribble with one hand or with two hands. Some of you might have a basketball at home. Now we're going to play catch, bounce, and catch, bounce, and catch, and we're going to throw it back and forth, and 
all kinds of fun games you can come up with at home with your family members. Have fun, kids. See you later.